Hi folks, this is Jason. Hope you're okay today. It's good to be with you. I just want to share with you uh, a debate that I listened to uh, the other day uh, by uh, N.T. Wright and John Dominic Crossan. Uh, uh, it was a lecture, it was a debate on the resurrection of Christ at New Orleans Baptist Theological Seminary um, a year or two ago. Uh, you can find it on the YouTube channel uh, Thomist Theist um, and if you type in N.T. Wright and Dominic Cross on debate on the resurrection of Jesus uh, you should find uh, a link to the debate and uh, so I just want to share with you my thoughts on the debate I, I thoroughly enjoyed the debate but before I do I'm just going to open in prayer Father God I thank you for this day and I thank you for your love and I thank you for your grace. I give you the praise and the glory and the honor. And um, I pray, Father, that you bless uh, this discussion, Lord, in your name and for your glory. Amen. Amen. Okay. Uh, the first thing I want to say is I've given N.T. Wright some severe criticism recently. Uh, basically, I do think uh, that he's gone off the rails concerning the doctrine of salvation. Now, I know there are many out there who are anti right fans and regard him as a great scholar, and I regard him as a great scholar too. I think he is one of the most outstanding New Testament scholars today. So I don't want to take away the fact that anti right is a brilliant scholar. And he's not only a brilliant scholar, he's a very likable person. But I do think that he's taken the metaphor of Israel to too far and applied it too much to his exegesis. And that has blurred and helping to blur people's understanding of personal salvation. And that is heretical. And um, if he continues to do that, he, he, Tom, uh, you're a heretic. I don't want to say that to such an eminent man. But if you are blurred in people's understanding of salvation, that's a very dangerous thing. Having said that, this debate I thoroughly enjoyed. I enjoyed N.T. Wright's scholarship on this particular uh, debate. And I enjoyed Dominic Crosser. Both of them are whimsical, highly, highly articulate.